Hey guys, what's up? It's Matthew here. Hope you're all doing well. You know, we're just here doing another video. We're talking about editing on a mobile device because, you know, when you think about it, not everyone will have a computer to edit their videos on. So the question is, can you edit videos on a mobile device? Stick around, we're going to answer that one. All right, so the first thing we're gonna look at is that with a mobile device, you know, you always have that device with you most of the time, especially if it's your smartphone. So that's reason number one. You can edit your videos anywhere you are. So whether you're at a doctor's office, you're waiting for a bus or the train, you can stay right there and edit your videos. You can do anything you want to it right there and then so you don't have to think that you know I have to wait until I get home get to the computer or so and well we remember we mentioned earlier that not everyone will have one so you have no choice of doing it on a computer so that's reason number one edit your pictures just about anywhere you are the second reason is that you're able to import your videos quicker than having to wait until you get home to your computer to pop out the memory card, pop it in your card reader, you know, or however you get your pictures to your computer, whether it's a Google Drive or OneDrive or however you do it. So while you are on your shoot, you have just finished, you can transfer those pictures directly from your camera to your phone right there because most if not all cameras nowadays have the capability to do that. You have Wi-Fi or Bluetooth, you know, that you can use to connect both devices and transfer the videos. Now, what this means is that you're still on the shoot. You can sit, you can look at all the different clips that you have, you know, look at the sound. If you're not happy with anything, then you can say, okay, I think we need to do this again because you're not happy with it. Now, if you went home, with that memory card and that computer you you transferred it to your computer and then you realize that you just don't like it then I think you see where I'm going with this so yeah that's the reason number two you're able to import your pictures or your videos rather to your device quicker reason number three is that it speeds up your workflow so meaning that instead of waiting until you get home on your computer to use Adobe Premiere or DaVinci Resolve or Final Cut, you can use your editing software that are available on mobile. You know, I personally use LumaFusion or KineMaster. You know, so whatever device or not device, but whatever app you want to use, you can use it to drag and drop your clips on the timeline to arrange them, you know, how you like them to be arranged. You can add some color to your clips do some color corrections. You can even add your music. If you want to add a preset, you can add that. So what that means is that when you get to your computer to, if you, you know, let's say you're going to use a computer to edit your clip some more, then it's much easier for you because you now have it in your mind how you want everything to look and to sound because you have a pattern right there on your smart device or your smartphone or your tablet whatever device it is that you're using, right? So folks, you know, those are three reasons why editing on your mobile device is, is a good idea to do so. So if you found this video helpful, you know, please leave a like and remember to subscribe and I'll see you in the next one.